Welcome back. It's time to go assault the warden keep at Edamant. Cresswood has had no further trouble with the undead. After what happened, it will take time for the village to recover. to work. Inquisitor. Let's see what we have. Adam and Fortress has stood against the Darkspawn since the time of the Second Blight. Fortunately for us, that means it was built before the age of modern siege equipment. A good trebuchet will do major damage to those ancient walls. And thanks to our Lady Ambassador... Lady Cyril of Jader was pleased to lend the Inquisition her sappers. They've already delivered the trebuchets. That is the good news. And the bad news? Erimond called the ritual at the Western Approach a test. He may already be raising his army of demons in the fortress. The Inquisition forces can breach the gate, but if the Wardens already have their demons, I found records of Adamant's construction. There are choke points we can use to limit the field of battle. That's good. We may not be able to defeat them outright. But if we cut off reinforcements, we can carve you a path to Warden Commander Clorel. So our plan is to lay siege to a legendary fortress filled with demons? It'll be hard fought, no way around it. But we'll get that gate open. It's also possible that some Wardens may be sympathetic to our cause. The Warriors may be willing to listen to reason, though I doubt they will turn against Clorel directly. The Mages, however, are slaves to Corypheus. They will fight to the death. We've built the siege engines and readied our forces, Inquisitor. Give the word, and we march on Adamant. Let us begin!
Pull back! They're through! All right, Inquisitor. You have your way in. Best make use of it. We'll keep the main host of demons occupied for as long as we can. That's a worrying lack of specificity there, Commander. There are more of them than I was hoping, Inquisitor. You don't say. Warden Logain will guard your back. Hawk is with our soldiers on the battlements. She's assisting them until you arrive. <sighs> There's too much resistance on the walls. Our men on the ladders can't get a foothold. If you can clear out the enemies on the battlements, we'll cover your advance. Fighting side by side with Logain, it feels good. <laughs> and I'm gonna kill these bloody fools. Imbeciles. Fuck the wardens. This is sure idiocy, what's happening here. The Inquisition army though will prevail. I assume we have the numbers, but then again, they have demons. So I can go there. Stay back. We will not be sacrificed for some insane ritual. I'm gonna go on the battlement. Need to help the soldiers up there. Get Hawk. Mm. Well, they're dead. Clear the area around the ladder.
Yes, let's take them on. Well, Hawk will buy me time there. Oh, come on. Oops. Well, a level has been gained. Where is... Well, regardless. forces and see that they survive this. I'll keep the demons off them as best I can. Yeah, I don't really need Hawk. So, sure, I'll send her to protect some of my men. Tough bastard. But he will die eventually.
Push forward. Good, we push forward. Then. Wardens! We are betrayed by the very world we have sworn to protect! The Inquisition is inside, Clarel. We have no time to stand on ceremony. These men and women are giving their lives, Magister. That might mean little in Tavinta, but for the Wardens, it is a sacred duty. It has been many long years, my friend. Too many, Clarel. If my sword arm can no longer serve the Wardens, then my blood will have to do. It will. We must complete the ritual! Hello! You complete that ritual! You're doing exactly what Eremon wants! What? Fighting the Blight? Keeping the world safe from Darkspawn? Who wouldn't want that? And yes, the ritual requires blood sacrifice! Hate me for that if you must, but do not hate the Wardens for doing their duty! We make the sacrifices no one else will. Our warriors die proudly for a world that will never thank them. And then he takes your mages' minds for his real master, Corypheus. Corypheus? But he's dead. These people will say anything to shake your confidence, Clarell. Bring it through! Please, I've seen more than my share of blood magic. It is never worth the cost. I betrayed the Wardens once, and it cost me everything! Are you mad enough to think I'd do it again? Be ready with the ritual, Clarell. This demon is truly worthy of your strength. Blackwall, can you talk some sense into them? You don't know me. But you may have heard my name. Like you, I've given my life to the Grey Wardens. The first time I put on this armor, I felt like I belonged. Like I was part of something honorable. Something with a purpose. I know how good that feels. How safe. But fighting and dying here today won't stop the Blight. If you want to stop the Blight, kill that bastard up there. His master is the living embodiment of its corruption.
Pharrell, we have come so far. You're the only one who can do this. Perhaps we could test the truth of these charges to avoid more bloodshed. Or perhaps I should bring in a more reliable ally. My master thought you might come here, Inquisitor. He sent me this to welcome you. Very well, let's fight. The Order Majors are beyond salvation, though. They've got a lot of mages in the Wardlands, though. There were what, 200 Wardlands in Orle? That's what Riordan says, anyway. Yeah, Liliana, that's great while I'm fighting a pride demon. Well, sorry, Varric.
That thrift should be closed, but all right. Guess we have to do it the hard way then. We will. Okay, I'm going up. Chlorel, stop, will you? Well, that was a brilliant move by the Inquisitor. Inquisitor opened a rift. We came through and survived. I never thought I would ever find myself here physically. Look, the Black City, almost close enough to touch. This must be very exciting for you, Solus. Any advice you have on what exactly is going on would be wonderful. What spirit commands this place? I have never seen anywhere like it. It's not how I remember the Fade either. Perhaps it's because we're here physically, instead of just dreaming. The stories say you walked out of the Fade at Haven. Was it like this? I don't know. I still can't remember what happened the last time I did this. Well, whatever happened at Haven, we can't assume we're safe now. That huge demon was right on the other side of that rift Aramond was using, and there could be others. In the real world, the rift producing the demons was nearby in the main hall. Can we return to the world through that? Let's find out. There, let's go. This is fascinating. It is not the area I would have chosen, of course. But to 
physically walk within the Fade. Right. You like it here. Isn't that wonderful? Yes. Literally. Solus, you're the expert on this place. Anything helpful? The Fade is shaped by intent and emotion. Remain focused, and it will lead you where you wish to go. The demon that controls this area is extremely powerful. Some variety of fear, I would guess. I suggest you remain wary of its manipulations, and prepare for what is certain to be a fascinating experience. Fascinating, he says. More like dreadful, but it mildly. Cosin here on Serious Gaming signing out. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned for more.